ASP.NET Web Applications can connect to any web service over the internet. You can then call their web methods in exactly the same way as any other c -sharp method. In this lesson, you will create a reference to a web service and call its methods. This is sometimes called consuming a web service. To begin, open the StableBase project from your Sample Files folder. Now you're going to add a service reference to link to the News Service web service. To do this, right-click on References in the Solution Explorer and click Add Service Reference from the shortcut menu. Note that the professional version of Visual Studio allows you to create web references as well as service references. Web references are almost identical to service references, but are slightly simplified. With the skills covered in this lesson, you should have no problems using web references. The Add Service Reference dialog appears, prompting you to enter the address of a web service. You could connect to any web service anywhere on the internet by typing its address into the address box and clicking Go. In this example, however, you're going to connect to a web service that is part of this project. To do this, click Discover. Your web service is discovered and appears in the Services box. Expand New Service in the Services box by clicking the small arrow to the left of newservice.asmx. Now expand News Service and click News Service SOAP. The Get News and Hello World methods are detected and displayed in the Operations box. You worked with these methods in Lesson 9-1. Now in the Namespace box, type News Service Reference and click OK. The web service is now available to your application under the News Service Reference namespace. You're going to add some code to the default.aspx page that will call the getNews method from the web service and display the results on the page. Open the code behind file of default.aspx and add the following code to the page load event handler. News service reference dot news service soap client remote web service equals new news service reference dot news service soap client the news service reference namespace contains the news service soap client class this class can be used to call the methods of the web service now add the following code on the next line. String news items equals remote web service dot get news dot to array. This code calls the get news method of the web service and retrieves its return value as a string array. Now add the following code on the next line for each string item in news items label news dot text plus equals item plus an HTML break tag. This code 
iterates through the items in the string array and displays their values in the label news control on the page. View default.aspx in your browser now. And as you can see, the two news items are retrieved from the web service and displayed on the page. Close your web browser now and close Visual Studio. You've now completed Lesson 9.2 Use a service reference to connect to a web service.